I am Dr. Sanjay Gupta. I am a senior physician in Stanford Hospital in Kaikondra Halli in Bangalore. If you look at a context in terms of the normal individual, testosterone is an androgenic hormone or androgenic male hormone which also decides the virility of the individual. Not necessarily testosterone levels will be associated directly with the sterility or male infertility because there are many factors which play a role when we talk about male infertility. So we are going into a different section and a different uh, basket of uh, problems as which are multifactorial when you talk about male infertility. So to start with let us not associate testosterone levels directly to male infertility even though it is one of the important factors. Now coming to the point at how much testosterone is needed in an individual is variable. As you know the testosterone levels fluctuate and it has a wide range in any normal individual or an individual which needs testosterone. Sometimes we call it low normal, sometimes we call it average. But it's always important to associate it with the symptoms. Like you said, male infertility can be one of the presenting manifestations where you look for testosterone, but you look for other factors also. Similarly, to decide what is the correct level of testosterone in an individual has to be looked into in a lot of clinical setting. So it is important to have a holistic view of the individual, including psychology, including metabolic factors, including other hormones in the body, including lifestyle. I think everything plays a major role in male infertility.